What's up everybody, Drifty here from Driftwood Gaming, and in this RPG Maker MV tutorial, we're going to learn how to make some healing skills using Phoenix Kagedisu's Alpha ABS system. So first, I'll show you the skills, and then we'll make them. Let's uh, select our hero quickly. And we're going to choose the Revival Mystic, which is a class that you can play in this game that I'm working on. Which is frankly irrelevant, you put these skills on whatever class you want. Um, we're going to level up quickly, get our first skill. So our first skill is called uh, Wave of Purity, and it's an instant cast that lets you um, uh, heal yourself with a 12-second cooldown. And you can see the formula in the, the description, but I'll go through it in the database as well. So basically, we'll get into a fight and uh, take some damage here. Using a cane, you don't have much melee as a, as a healer. But when you take some damage, you press 1, use your skill, whatever key you bind it to, and it'll instantly heal you up. So that's the first one. So we're going to gain some more skills. Uh, another skill we'll take a look at real quick is uh, Dia, and that's just, just like Ignite in one of the past uh, tutorials, except it deals light damage and uh, inflicts a damage over time effect. So we'll just go ahead and level up again. A lot of these skills we've already covered, so I'm not going to go over all of them. Um, this is, a, oh, we already went over this one too, Meditate. So that's going to basically give us our MP back at the expense of TP. I remember going over that, so I'm going to pass through that one. Uh, I believe we went over this skill too. Uh, that's our healing, uh, like a regen uh, skill. This is going to add a state. It's another skill. We'll go over all these skills, but I want to make this video sort of specific to the healing skills. So we just got our, um, our next healing skill. And we'll take a look at that one. And this is called Grand Heal. And it's gonna uh, it's not an instant cast, it takes two seconds to cast it, but it also has a 12 second cooldown. It costs quite a bit more uh, MP and it uh, it heals for a lot more. So costs more MP and it's not an instant, so uh, it'll take it, it's gonna it's gonna heal for a lot more than uh, your wave of purity will. So we'll take a look at those two skills really quickly. How would you make something like that? All right, so looking at Wave of Purity, wherever it's at, here it is. Um, so I made it a magic type, scoping uh, the user, battle screen so you can use it with ABS, set it to magical attack and gave it a custom animation, set the message to cast. We're using the type HP recover, an element of light, but you can change this up to whatever you want. Same thing with the damage formula. I'm basing it off of a, uh, Magic attack power plus magic defense. Uh, magic defense will be the stat that uh, toggles uh, or controls how much healing you actually do. So magic defense isn't just for taking less damage from magic attacks, but it also increases all of your healing magic in this game. Uh, so separating magic attack to be mostly for offensive magic and magic defense for like restorative uh, magic, also including luck in most of the skills to give luck more of an important role and make it more of a valid stat to choose. Um, so the note tags, I'll put it in the box here. We've got ABS0, which creates an instant cast. Reload time of 720, that's going to give 12 seconds of a cooldown on it. So Grand Heal is similar. Uh, but it's going to be, um, it's going to have a speed to it. So this right here is making it so that it takes two seconds. So when we set our speed using the ABS, that's saying how long is it going to take to cast. So uh, ABS zero doesn't necessarily mean instant. It basically means uh, as soon as the speed is met, it's going to use that skill with no like a vector icon or no circle. It's just going to target whatever it's specifically targeting, the target, uh, like one enemy or the user. And if you set speed to 120, that's going to be two seconds casting time. Reload time is your delay, uh, your cooldown delay. So 12 second timer on that. A uh, similar thing right here, except we're asking for more MP for the cost and we're increasing the the numbers in the formula for that. Give it a custom animation, set it to cast. All of this stuff is malleable. You can put it to whatever numbers you want. Just the, the note tags are really what you're going to be looking for as well as the speed on those. So it's pretty simple as you can see to make a, a healing uh, spell. 
Um, taking a look at Dia, if you've watched me make Ignite in one of the earlier videos on the Alpha ABS tutorial, then you'll see this is very similar. The only thing different is it's now using light and it inflicts a different state um, instead of, uh, of the burning state. Uh, it inflicts a state that is actually reducing the defense, I believe. But really, that's going to do it for this uh, quick tutorial on how to make some healing skills using Phoenix Kage Disu's Alpha ABS system, which is a really awesome system. Uh, more to come on this system. If you have any special requests, things you'd like to learn how to do, specifically using Phoenix Kage Disu's Alpha ABS system, let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, I wouldn't be opposed to that. If you want to hook up with some people, start a project, you can check out driftwoodgaming.com. We've got a forum there where you can introduce yourself and uh, network with some people. But that's going to do it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We'll see you in the next one.